Hello and welcome back to the channel. This week you join me in Limington, Hampshire for the Rotary Club of Limington's Classic Car Show event and fun day. It's going to be a fantastic day, lots of cars here already, so let's just see what's turned up. So first off, I, I, I followed this um, American barge in this morning. George looks absolutely swamped by the um, size of that American car next to him. What a difference in size. So you've got a big American pickup there. Not sure what that is, that's lovely. LMG. X type. Did we see that at Cars on the Key? That's a different one, I think it's lovely. Lovely little MG. Triumph Dolomite 1500, lovely. Ford console. Datsun, was that in yeah, that's a Datsun, yeah. And then a modern BMW, we we'll ignore that. What a fantastic turnout. Well, Escort State in beige, look at that. Merc 350SL. Lovely. Lovely Jeep there. Crayford Cortina, look at that. Well, what an absolutely fantastic turnout. This is all because of the Limington Rotary Club of Hampshire. They're a charitable organisation, they do great things. I'll put a link to their website in the video description. But uh, yeah, let's carry on and see what there is to see. So at these events they have a club stand. This is a Jaguar Enthusiasts Club. Fabulous old commercial vehicle. So early console Capri there. Ford Prefect. And a Plymouth P10. Let's take a close look. Uh, 60s Beetle, split spring camper, Porsche, Beetle, Common Gear, Lovely early mini there. Liking that a lot. Four Granada Estate. With a console Capri. MGB. Big old Austin. Extra Volvo 480, that's a bit of a contrast. Triumph TR8. Three and a half litre with Allegra door handles, fantastic. Well, they all came out of the BL parts bin, but that's just awesome to see. Is that, is that an Alpha Sud? I think it is an Alpha Sud. Indeed. That's what the interior of an Alpha Sud looks like. Actually, the last time I saw one of those was Festival of the Unexceptional back in 2019, and that was on the back of a trailer looking quite sorry for itself. It was nice to see a decent one in the flesh. But let's carry on. And oh, now that's that Capri again. We saw that at Christchurch Quay. Ford's F4. They're always nice to see. Let's get closer to you. And in case you're interested, it's for sale.
Nothing like that, that's awesome. Yeah, that's awesome. Because then that's Edwardian. What a fantastic example. Oh, look at that, even complete with telephone. All of the luxury. Uh, off the bat, lovely little Austin A30. Couple of MGBs. Portion 944. Is that a Ford F100 pickup? Datsun, we saw that coming in. Ford console. Rover P4, three and a half litre. Sorry, P5. Jaguar. <laughs> Triumph GT6 there. Another stag. Another stag. Ford Zodiac. Ford Capri Laser. Epic. Nice to see those. Sunbeam Rapier. Lovely. Triumph TR5. Cadillac DeVille Convertible. Complete with Elvis. Fiat 130 Saloon, very rare. And that, that's an MGTC from about 1948. Lovely. Another VW camper there, this one showing its engine off. Oh no, this is nice to see, this is a Rover 2000, so not the 3.5 litre V8, but just a straight 2 litre. They also did a 2.2 version of these. That's always nice to see. Now this is awesome to see. This is a Citroen DS Safari. And now they look so practical with the extra seats at the back. Fantastic. 635 CSI. Lovely. Toyota Celica from about 1988. Not sure about the steering wheel, but. Ford Granada Mark 1. It's a 2 litre GL from 1976. Fantastic. Nice to see a completely unmessed with engine there. That's just how they should be. So, as part of the show, there's a car boot sale and family sort of fun day out going on today. So, there's uh, ice cream vans, food, refreshments. A bouncy castle if you're into that sort of thing. I'm too old for that. Uh, also look a bit old with the little kids, so we won't go there. Uh, oh, ice cream van. Back in a sec. Lovely collection of alpines there. So this is actually based on a single chamois convertible, it's a nymph body, bit of a kit car, but yeah, lovely. Let's take a closer look. Yeah, liking that a lot. So I've just come back over this way because I've spotted a couple of late arrivals. It's a Triumph for Tess. That's a Talbot Matra. Sorry, Matra. Fantastic. Can't remember the last time I saw one of those.
Lovely. Little old Austin there. Look, it's Bruce. How you doing, mate? I'm all right, you? Good, thank you. Now, we've seen this before at Burley Man, haven't we? We have, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's been everywhere, this car. It's like the local bike. Couple of MGBs there. I like that, work in progress. They don't all have to be show queens, folks. Just bring along what you've got. And look at this stunning example. This is the 1932 Morris Minor. Had an 845cc engine. What an example. Lovely Ford Anglia estate there. They're quite rare. A Dolomite. Two CV, two two CVs. Was that a Diane? Yeah, I think that's a Diane. Let's take a closer look. Hubnut would know. It is indeed a Diane, but look at the. I just spotted that. That's fantastic. No cheese baguettes or wine left on the circle overnight. Beautiful old Volvo there. Classic Mini. I think we missed it. Must have missed this one. Another shot of the Volvo, it's a 1800. Lovely. Well, it was a bit of a hope, really, but I thought there might have been another Allegro along today, but um, George does look like he's on his own, but, yeah, what a fantastic turnout. Well, that's going to do it for this video. Thanks ever so much for watching. Coming along for the ride today, guys. It's been a fantastic show and turnout. Thanks ever so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done that before, and I shall see you in the next one.